So, first of all, before this video starts, I just want to quickly say I apologize to anyone who's been waiting for this video to come out. I know a lot of people need help downloading this mod, but I just have a very big fear that it'll get taken down once again. And if it does, then of course my channel is going to get a strike for the second time. That's all. Let's get on with the video. So, you want to know how to download Will's Texture Overhaul mod for Bully Scholarship Edition? Very easy to do. All you have to do is go to LinkedIn description for the Nexus page. It'll look like this. That means you have the right place, of course. And all you do is click the manual download. And if you don't have an account, then be sure to make an account. Also, be sure to frequently look at this page because it could update at any time. Click manual download when you want to download it, and then click slow download. Now, this typically takes me a while to download. I don't quite know why, but it just does. Uh, it's two gigabytes large, so just wait for it to download. Also, nice to add, linked in the description will be Will's YouTube channel. This, he has showcase videos every now and then about the mod, stuff he does. This is a really good place to look at any upcoming details, and he also came out with a fix on how to fix um, the mod if it crashes for you, which is something I'm going to go on topic about at the end of the video, and also I'm going to make a separate video on the topic because some people might be looking for that specific video. Alright, so mine just installed, so I'm going to go to my file explorer. There we go, it's right here, so I'm going to right click, 7-zip, and extract it. You can use WinRAR or whatever you have. Now this might take a while to extract too, so you just wait. So it's just about to be done. There we go. So now we double click the folder, and there'll be two other folders in here. So we're going to do stream folder first. So navigate to your bully directory root folder, whatever you want to call it. So the way to get to root folder is you go to bully. On Steam, you right click, manage, browse local files, and then you're on the root folder. So what you do is you drag your stream folder into here, and then you just drop it in the root folder, and it'll tell you to replace some files. Click replace, because of course that's what it's about. So when that's done, now you need to drop this will folder in brackets. You need to drop this into your drive that you where you downloaded Bully at. So you can see from up here, if I just click on this, you can see mine's D drive, schemes, the apps, and all that. But you can see it's on my D drive. So I'm going to go to this PC, data D, and then I'm just going to drop it right here. Now, if you have this on your C drive, you'll just do that, but on your C drive instead. But I put my games on my D drive because my C drive is for editing and all my video stuff. So I'm just going to drop it in here. So then when that is done, you should be able to be good. Now, if you don't crash when you load into your game, then do not worry about this last part of the video. You're done. Should I exit out of the video? Do whatever. If you experience crashing in this game, you're going to have to download a patch for the game. It's not that difficult. Don't worry. It's even not that big in your space. This is how you do it. So link down below is going to be a video made by Will himself where it kind of has, he kind of showcases it working. He goes out the dorm and it fixes everything and everything. So in his description, there's a Mediafire link. I have actually tried this myself and this does work. So don't worry about it. So all you do is click this file link and take you to this Mediafire link and you download it. It's only two megabytes. It's really not that big. It's not going to take long. So here it is in my downloads. You just want to extract it, of course, just like you did with the other files. And it's just going to be the simple exe. Don't try running it or whatever. There's really no point in doing that. Just browse your local files and then drop the exe in here, just like you did with the stream folder. And it works perfectly. You can run the game through basic bully and it should just work. And that's it. If you have any questions, which people typically do, go down in the description down below and let me know if this worked for you, or did not work for me, or or did not work for you, and uh, goodbye everyone.